the Niners offense against the Rams defense, which is a hell of a defense. I don't know how much you guys have watched of it. There's a new defensive coordinator who is a Vic Fangio disciple, and the structure of the defense looks exactly like those Harbaugh defenses from eight, nine years ago. So pick a matchup from that side of the ball. Um, it can be players. It can be coaches. Um, you guys pick. Jack? Good, buddy. Yep. I'll go. Uh, I, I really the 49ers really need to be able to run the ball. So I want to see I want to see Raheem, Raheem Mostert uh, attack this Rams defense. I want to see what they can do. Get him downhill. Uh, get him out. You know, get him downhill. Get him some. He does seem to be running really well on those top sweeps as well. Uh, try to try to make the, these these Rams guys run sideline to sideline. Uh, try to wear them out. Try to do that early and often throughout the first half of the game. So in the second half, if you're still if it's still close, you have a chance. Mm. Yeah, I'm going to go a little bit similar. Just say for 49ers offensive line against the defensive line. I mean, obviously, you know, Donald. But I just think it's – I just think what's going to be key is like exactly what Jack said, those stretch runs, toss plays. You really have to rely on Moser to get Garoppolo comfortable and allow to play action, boots, all that. So that way the Rams defense is second-guessing what they're doing because you don't want to get in the similar scenario. It was like, great, now you're already down. You didn't give the defense enough time. To even to even rest or anything, and now you're in a you're in a position where you're forced to come back, and I don't think that offense is really built like that. So yeah, I want to see more Mostert. You know, hopefully we see maybe even see some Jermichael Hasty. Why not throw him out there because he might seem good? Because I think Jeff Wilson was working out there. Um, that's probably that's the best combo in my opinion. See Mostert and Hasty out there because the vision and at least the way how they just seeing how they're a lot of quickness. So offense, four nines offensive line, you're not going to get much between the tackles. I just think going horizontal is the way they go. All right. So Kyle Shanahan versus Kyle God, I like Shanahan. that. God, I like that. It versus himself. Like, he's got to run the ball. If they have any shot to win, it's got to be 35 yeah. times this game. Um, he said – that the lack of the running the ball was because of the scores, uh, the games, the game flow. Well, the Eagles game was a one score game throughout all four quarters, and you ran the ball 20 times with preach, preach. Yeah. <laughs> you ran the ball 20 times. That there's it's a one score game. Like, what, what excuse are you using against that game? And then they're rushing the ball at a higher rate this year at five yards an average compared to 4.6 last year, which got them second best in the NFL. And last year, so back-to-back -back games, 20, 20 attempts, 19 attempts. The only time Shanahan ran the ball for 20 attempts last year was once in 16 games. Less he just 20. did it back-to-back. -back. Yeah. 20, 20, yeah. like the, he did it 20 times. Okay. Or a game only once. Okay. And so everything else has been more than 20 last season. 15 other games. He went back-to-back -back weeks with 20 and 19. Bad. I love that answer. Shanahan against himself. That's the answer of the day so far. I wish I had thought of it. Uh, <laughs> look, yes, the game is going to come down to the Niners run game. They are efficient on the ground. And I'm telling you, this Rams defense is really good. The only weakness they seem to have is the run defense technically. And some, and they actually, I think, held Washington to like 30 rushing yards last week. I think they gave up 108 total yards. It's a really good defense. But – so what you got to know about it, this new defensive coordinator is using Ramsey differently. He's in the slot a lot. He used to be an outside corner. Now he's in the middle of the action. And I think he's going to be covering Kittle all game, which means, which is good news for the Niners run game because Kittle can block him. But it's bad news for the Niners passing game. Ramsey is, I think he's given up 11 catches on 23 targets this year. He's great. And as good as Kittle is, he's not the greatest route runner. I, so that means... If they're going to have any success in the air, and it's important that they throw the ball a little or else they're not going to be able to run, run the ball enough, um, they, they need the two young wide receivers, Ayuk and Debo, to have success against Troy Hill and D Darius Williams. Uh, those guys are pretty good. It's a really good defense. It's a good pass rush. But if those two young wide receivers step up, uh, then the Niners should win this game. So I, I'm curious to see what the young wide receivers can do because so far – they haven't played that well. And what, what just now, about an hour ago, I asked George Kittle, why are you confident this team can turn it around and make the playoffs? He eventually got to, um, well, we're relying heavily on two young starting wide receivers and they should just get better as the season goes on. So they could use uh, a, a jump this week from those two. And I'm, I'm curious to see it because they're not going against Xavier and Howard 
and Byron Jones. They're going against Troy Hill and Darius Williams, who are playing well, but they're Troy Hill and Darius Williams. So let's let's see it, guys. Yeah. It'll happen once Jimmy Garoppolo sees the throwing windows. Yeah. Because uh, the way they're covering Kittle, he has a zone wide open if Jimmy holds the ball for literally a half a second more. But what he's doing, it. this is what Steve Young alluded to on KNBR. He looks at George Kittle. He goes, he's covered, looks off George Kittle. Um, instead, if he just stayed on Kittle, waits that half second, and he finds that throwing window, or by looking around so much and jumping from receiver to receiver, you often find yourself throwing the ball late. And that's what happened with the Dolphins, and that Xavier Howard took advantage. Real quick, what you said about Shanahan against himself, what I'd like to see from Shanahan is, like, remember that first drive from the Rams against the Niners last year uh, in L.A., where the Rams just ran the ball eight times and scored a touchdown? I'd like to see the Niners do that. How about an entire opening drive with just runs, like the entire array, end arounds, reverses, jet sweeps, shock and awe on the ground, establish your running game. Why not? They can do it. Get Ayuka touch on the first drive. Get Debo with Samuel a touch on the first drive. And let Ayuk return punts. My goodness, Cooper Cup returns punts for the for the Rams. I mean, what is why is what is Kyle Shanahan afraid of? What's gonna happen on this punt return that's so dangerous? Get him the ball. Raheem Mostert too.